Did you hear it last night? I sure did. What was it like? It was uh, um, in bed, and I hear, rat -tat 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 -tat. and I'm thinking, is that a gun? No, it can't be a gun. It just can't be a gun. It can't be. This, this is your neighbor. This is your neighborhood. How, how you feeling? I mean, sad, mad, I'm furious. I am furious, not just for my neighborhood, for the whole country. If I hear one more time, thoughts and prayers. <laughs> Excuse me, can't say <laughs> on TV. What are we gonna do? We're so politically divided. She's I right. We want to disagree about the economy or, you know, I don't know, immigration, whatever. Fine. We cannot disagree about this. No. Mm -mm. We have to do something. I don't care what your political leanings are. We can't continue to let people kill people. Mm -hmm. Most people who support the Second Amendment don't even know what it's about. They don't mm -hmm. even know what it says. It's because we didn't have a standing army that you needed a well-regulated militia. And I certainly don't feel safe knowing that a whole bunch of good law-abiding citizens are packing, you know, or have AR-15s, including my brother. Mm. I can't even see him. I'd probably wring his neck. Yeah. I, I just... Oh, I'm sorry, ma'am. We, we, we jumped in on this. You seem like you're pretty emotional about what happened. What can you tell us? Um, I can't believe I'm even like this. I, I heard it last night. What amazed me, all the, after the rat-a-tat-tat, was it was fairly quiet. I mean, I didn't hear, I heard a siren, it sort of, and then I realized this morning, I guess all the police were here already. It's not like they had to send cars in from all over. And, you know, I eventually went to sleep. I tossed and turned, and then I got up this morning and I opened the news, and sure enough, it was what I didn't think it could be, <laughs> you know, outside my door, I, you know, and, and I texted some family members, and I just um, started crying. I, and, you know, I'm retired and think, what's my purpose now? I think it's to fight this. There's a march on Saturday. We've got to get people out all over the country. We've got to get them to Washington. You know, think about 1963 and Martin Luther King's. It changed something. And I think if you know, a million people descend on Washington, maybe this will change something. Maybe. Thanks. I don't...